Bundesliga team of the season is here. There's some solid cards. I believe a Lewandowski. Um, I believe a Muller, obviously. I think Sancho as well. Haaland. There's a whole bunch of them. There's some very, very solid cards. Today, we are going to be looking at the new objectives, a flashback. Rusilion, I believe it's pronounced. And I can't lie, boys. I remember this dude's summer heat near the end of last FIFA. And I only used him for like 20 to 30 games because, I mean, it was relatively late on to the game. I didn't play too much with him until I believe I got moments from Roberto Carlos uh, to replace him. But what I did use of him last FIFA, he was absolutely unreal. I really did like his summer heat. I believe they made him five star something, which was just really, really fun to use. But today, boys, if you are new to the series, we're going to look over this card, look over these objectives, give you guys my tips. Also, I'm going to answer some questions I do commonly get asked quite a lot with all these objective guides. And we're going to go ahead and we're going to take a look at the new Bundesliga Beast game mode. And I'm going to build a team between 20 and 30,000 coins for you guys to go ahead and help you speed up your process completing this card. So starting off, assist 5 goals using defenders in the light foot friendly, Bundesliga best, and like I said, we'll have a look at the light foot friendly in a minute, but one thing I always know is assist 5 goals with defenders, um, this means you can play a left back, say a left back starting at left back, and in game, chuck a pause, move that left back to left wing, move that left back to left cam, move that left back to striker if you want to try and get that done, you can do that, you do not really have to go out all the time, uh, and, and actually try to play with your centre backs, get assists with your centre backs and right backs, you can move them into a different position in game, assist two goals with crosses, once again you can knock two birds out with one stone, if you move a left back up to left wing in game, just get those crosses with that left back, or left wing sorry, with a cross and it is assist and a cross at the same time, score 15 goals, as easy as it sounds, win 8 matches and score a finesse goal in 12 separate matches, so this will take a minimum of 12 separate matches, which is 6 minutes a half, 12 minutes a game, Work that out yourself, it's a couple hours of a grind. But there is always golden goal, which obviously you guys probably know what golden goal is. Um, not everyone will be doing it in this game mode, especially because you need a score with assists and assists with, uh, well, sorry, yeah, assists with crosses and assists with defenders. Not everyone will be doing golden goal. Genuinely, with these objectives, I feel like maybe 50% of a community is doing golden goal. That's really just up to you if you want to do golden goal or not. Let's go over and let's have a look at the new game mode. So here we go. Bundesliga's best. Bundesliga players exactly 11, at least 5 clubs and at least 5 nationalities. So really, it's just going to be a full Bundesliga team. Obviously, you've got to try to get different clubs in here so people just don't rock a full blind squad. Hey boys, so this is what we have come up with. Like I said, this is the cheapest, I say the cheapest possible team. Obviously, if it's cheaper, but cheapest possible, quote-unquote, meta players that you can actually, you know, play the game with without having to worry how bad they are in-game. Because I know for a fact, I think I've literally used every single card in this team throughout the year, especially at the beginning of the game. Except I don't think I've used Pavlinka nor Hindrager. But I, I've actually used Hintry Giga, oh, I'm not sure how I pronounce his name, but I used his headliners in drafting, it was pretty good, so I, I, we're just going to go with his gold rare. But boys, starting off at left mid, we have gone for Bailey. Now, he is obviously from Jamaica and from Leverkusen, he plays for Leverkusen. You just need at least five nations and at least five clubs, which we've easily got. Leverkusen, Leipzig, we've got uh, Bayern, we have got Dortmund. It looks like we've also got Wolfsburg and Frankfurt and Werder Bremen. So I've got seven. I've gone overboard. You don't have to do that. But obviously, you just need to make sure you've got at least five different clubs and at least five nations in here. So like I said, at left mid, it is going to be Bailey. At striker, it's going to be the cheap Timo Werner, genuinely. He, he basically is a cheap Timo Werner. 93 pace. Although Timo Werner would in real life have 60 shooting, Wang Hee Chan is actually very solid in game. Uh, Balarabi as well. Now, I can say right now, Balarabi and all of these cards will be going up in price. Balarabi was 3k earlier with this new objective I'm literally going to guess he'll be going to 4 to 5k some maybe even more years he's around 3k still but he be, be careful, he may go up a little bit. Now in the midfield, we have gone for Tolisso, who in-game is actually very, very underrated. Three-star, three-star, very, very well-rounded. I believe he's got, yeah, only three or four orange stats, and they're not really stats that matter either. Now we have gone for Lema, and this dude at the beginning of the game, literally, I, I was playing squad battles in my starting rivals placement games with him, and he genuinely carried me throughout the 40 to 50 games. I, like, at the beginning of the game, he was on my road to glory. I used him on my main as well. Genuinely an absolutely unreal card for the price. We have also gone for Emre Chan, who once again, someone else that is very good for their price. At left back, we are using Rusilion in the Rusilion objectives. Center back is Hernandez for Bayern Munich. Uh, and like I said, I'm not going to try to pronounce his name again. Hintriger? Hintriger? 
Hintriger, maybe. I don't know. But like I said, I've used his headliners. Very underrated. Let's just say that. Very underrated. 71 pace. Very good defensively and very, very good physically as well. And at right back, the best Bundesliga gold rear right back, in my opinion, is Mbabu. And in net, we have just gone for Pavlinka. You've got an option of anyone, but the reason Pavlinka is my man is because he's got saves with feet trait and he is six foot five. That's all you need to know. He's basically the Bundesliga version of Nick Pope. So as I said, this team will tick all the uh, all, all of the ticks off. You'll be able to go into the game with this because, like I said, you've got 11 Bundesliga players, you've got at least five nations, and you've got at least five clubs. So first tip is obviously this team. 20 to 30,000 coins in that range could be a little bit more with players going up and it could be a little bit less as well. Now the second tip is literally just fill your team out, like fill your bench out with as much as you want. You can put your best players on your bench, there's no rating requirement, you can sub them on, your bench does not have to be buying players, just your starting 11 has to be buying players. So as you can see, I could sub on Alba, I could sub on Moments Figo, I could sub on my Pale or Hullet if I really wanted to. You can have as much good subs as you can. Like I said as well, you could sub on a right back or a left back at left wing or right wing. Or as I said earlier on, you could literally just like move your players up in game with the custom tactics and literally just move, let's say, Rusili on up to left wing in game and Babu up for Balarabi and then you can sub Balarabi and Bailey off for the players you've got on your bench. So that way your actual right back and left back will be playing as wingers because obviously getting an assist from left wing is much easier than getting an assist from left back. Boys heading into the third and final tip. It is going to be chemistry styles. Obviously you guys know chemistry styles are crucial. Take one here Chan for example, 93 pace, his shooting's not amazing, nor is his dribbling, so you're just stuck a finisher chemistry style on him. Cost you 200 coins or you'll probably have lots of them in your club. And according to Footbin, with a finisher chemistry style applied, Wang He Chan will go to an 82 rated striker in game, which I feel like is definitely uh, it's, it's a significant boost in game compared to just a basic normal chemistry style. So 100%, that's the third tip, is just get the chem styles on them. They don't have to be the exact right ones, you don't have to go out and buy shadows. Just any chem style is better than none. Like I said, assist five goals using defenders, you can just move right back and left backs up to right wing, assist two goals with crosses, you do not have to use defenders for crosses, but if you do want to, then it's two birds with one stone. And another way you could do this as well is literally if your opponent, if you score three goals and your opponent literally gets a finesse goal and, and he's one of the players that just jam the controller, you can just get it that way. This is a very easy objective, should take two to three hours. Golden goal as well will speed up the process, but as I said, not everyone will be doing that. Hopefully you guys did enjoy and let me know down below if you've got any other tips for anyone else, any questions, I'll try to get back to all of them. That's all we're about here, is we're just about trying to help the community out. Till next time boys, it's been Davis, make sure to sub if you did get anything helpful from this video, and until next time, I'll see you guys later.